。白宮發言人皮埃爾週一喺佢被任命為白宮發言人嘅職位之後，第一次喺簡報會上回答咗記者嘅提問。自拜登總統任期開始以嚟。一直擔任副白宮發言人嘅皮埃爾，係第一位擔任美國政府發言人嘅非洲裔美國人，同埋公開同性戀者。I am obviously acutely aware that my presence at this podium represents a few firsts. I am a black gay immigrant woman. The first of all three of those to hold this position, I would not be here today if it were not for generations of barriers, barrier-breaking people before me. I stand on their shoulders. If if it were not for generations of barrier barrier-breaking people before me, I would not be here. But、um, I benefit from their sacrifices. I have learned from their ex ex excellence, and I am forever grateful to them. Representation does matter. You hear us. You hear us say this、uh, often in this administration, and no one understands this better than President Biden. 皮埃爾回答咗有關紐約布法羅一間雜貨店發生嘅致命槍擊事件，嬰兒配方奶粉持續短缺，同埋特朗普喺總統任期內下令撤軍之後，將唔到五百名美軍重新部署喺索馬里嘅問題。喺特朗普撤軍之前，美國喺索馬里大約有七百名士兵，專注於幫助當地軍隊擊敗與基地組織有關嘅青年黨叛亂。皮埃爾對記者話：呢、这個係已經喺戰場上邊嘅部隊進行嘅重新定位，佢哋偶然會進出索馬里。簡報中冇提及到確切嘅部隊人數。關於布法羅出於種族動機嘅大屠殺，皮埃爾話：槍擊事件對呢個國家嘅結構嚟講係好可恨嘅，仇恨絕對唔可以有避風港。呢、这個同我哋作為一個國家嘅本性係背道而馳，亦都助長咗暴力